welcome to the Super League's roughest fixture. Invincible United versus Iron Tank. And today's showdown will be even more intense than usual. The winner gets a place in the Super League final. Super Strikers secured their spot last week and will no doubt be keeping a close eye on this game. Uh -huh. oh, got that right. got it. These guys suck. We would have scored four goals by now. Totally. Yeah. Please, dudes. The defenders are owning this game. Mmm. Defenders. Oh, you mean those guys I run past when I score the goals? The Automatic to take the throw in. Can United make something of this? I don't know, Mac. He's pretty far from the box. This is not good. from Invincible United, and it's all thanks to their new star man, Automatic! Yep, unless Super Strike us find a way to stop him, it'll be automatic victory for United in the final. Yep, we're totally done for. But you guys can stop anything in the air. Yeah, can't you just header it away? Headering ain't gonna help us against the long throw. Hey, eh? what are you talking about? A cross or a corner needs height to get distance, but Automatic's throw comes in low and hard, Rawr. like a cannonball. The slightest touch from anyone, even your own defenders, and the ball's in the back of the net. Yep. Mm. Whoa. Like a cannonball, hey? Eh? I think I know someone who can help us. Virgo, Virgo. Yeah, coach. This heading guru may have helped shakes, but defensive heading is totally different. Trust me, dudes. His methods are a little unusual. Power! His facilities are kind of low-tech. Accuracy! And he's really demanding. Guts! But when it comes to headers, no one's better than El Eliete, the battering ram. All right, all right. That training does sound kinda hardcore. Kinda? I'm the only player who ever passed. Shakes is right. If anyone can get you ready to face automatic, it's El Ariete. You have one week before the final. Make it count. Shakes, chances are this dude's waiting for us with a cannon. Uh -oh. All right, let's show El Ariete the Super Striker's defense is ready for anything. Strikers, welcome to header training. Have a complimentary gift bag. Uh, I was not ready for that. If you want to learn how to header, you must master three simple skills. First, power. <laughs> Accuracy. <laughs> and guts. Hello? Shakes, El Ariente's training is the worst. 
This place is a theme park, a tourist trap, a total gimmick. Are you sure it's the same El Ariete? Because the training I did was insane. Maybe you forwards just don't understand the meaning of real hardcore oh. training. If you don't believe me, just look in El Ariete's book of graduates. My name is the only one in there. <sighs> Whatever. Huh. We are just as hardcore as the Defenders. Yeah, in fact, I'm going to the day spa right now to get all these hardcore knots massaged out of my muscles. Yeah, good idea. I'm going to ask him to make my hot hot treatment extra hot. Come on, dude. We've wasted enough time here. The real training? Come on! Shix doesn't know what he's talking about. I mean, the dude thinks a jumping castle is hardcore. <laughs> okay, fine, fine. We look for the book. Where do you think El Ariente keeps it? If it even exists. And then we do 300 push-ups, wrestle a moose, and run up a mountain backwards. We are that hardcore. So, does that answer your question? Uh, no. I asked how North and Block plan to stop Automatic's throw-in. <laughs> Those slackers are relaxing in Ibiza. <gasps> Suspicious. There's no way Coach would give his defenders time off before the final. Doesn't matter, Vince. We've got him. We can't lose. Wrong. Automatic's throw is only the first step to guarantee our victory. And what's step two? Sabotage, of course. Those slackers are relaxing in Ibiza. <gasps> so, what's in Ibiza? The battering ram. is more like it. What are you doing here? Looking for the real header training. The one you gave Shakes? It is the same training Shakes got. Just in a safer, more controlled environment. We're about to face an unstoppable throw-in. We need the most hardcore header training there is. We need the battering ram. Sorry. That's just not me anymore. <sighs> Your training was so hardcore, only one player ever made it through. Now you hand out certificates to whoever shows up. Yep, it was worth a shot. Hot shots! You want the real head of training? You got it! Not bad, hot shots. When news of Shake's training got out, everybody wanted lessons. And, like you, they were very persistent. So eventually I gave them what they wanted. But I had already created my masterpiece. Something I thought I would never use.
The ultimate header training. So, no one's passed this? Ha! Huh. No one's even seen it. Huh? Hey! I thought we were the first people to come down here. Those aren't people. They're your opponents. <laughs> Super League News Flash. I'm Rob Ross. Uh, guys. While North Shaw and Block have gone missing in the build-up to the final, Scara is so confident he's taking a holiday in Ibiza. Ha! That guy gives us hardcore for it's a bad name. I'll take a holiday when I'm dead. Yeah. Or if the weather's nice. Or if there's a sale on clothes. Guys, that isn't a holiday. It's sabotage. My machine will teach you to defend against this so-called unstoppable throw-in. If you hot shots are up to the job. I've never seen a barrel score such an easy goal. Then start coaching, bro. What do we do? Stop behaving like defenders. Forget about the opposition. Attack the ball like a forward. No man marking? But that, that goes against everything we've ever learned. No risk. No reward. Aw, oh, closed. This sucks. So, where's this famous heading coach? Don't know. He's taking the day off. Or maybe he's giving private lessons. <laughs> Come on! Shots, I thought you were meant to be hardcore! Oh. Yes, you did it! <laughs> A Virgo! All right! Yeah! Now, to get you home in time for the Super League fight. <laughs> Sorry, losers, but Invincible United are gonna finish top of the ladder this season. <laughs> Think we can make it? No risk, no reward. Uh, not exactly what I meant, but... Wise guy? <laughs> not bad for a forward, eh? Hey? Well, well, well. The defenders finally show up. You guys aren't the only ones who did hardcore training. We walked on the hot pavement, barefoot. And only waited 10 minutes after eating before taking a swim. And? Did you learn how to stop automatics throw? Yeah, turns out the trick is to attack the ball like a forward. Ha-ha! <laughs> Told you guys forwards were the most hardcore. Block and North may be able to stop automatic, but it'll take all of you to win the trophy. 
One, two, three, Super Striders! So I drop it right, and I'm like, we're gonna finish top of the ladder, huh? That's why I have three steps to guarantee victory. Oh yeah? And what's the third? Always have an ace up your sleeve. Okay, Mr. Buckethead. I have one last mission for you. <laughs> Welcome to the Super League Final. Invincible United versus Super Strikers. Great reception for both sides today. And great reception for me. <laughs> United must be the favorites here. Even the mighty Iron Tank had no answer for automatic throw-in. Can Super Striker's defense do any better? Game on! Easy to guess Invincible United's game plan. Yep, get the ball out. And into Automatic's deadly hands. Unusual positioning from North and Block. You need to mark a man. Yeah, that's what we thought. I hope you two know what you're doing. Hmm. And there it is, the deadly long throw. Win a game, Brenda. Indeed. If it carries on like this, it's going to penalties. Ha! About time. All right, boys, T sharp. Only three minutes more. Uh, guys. They're bringing their goalie forward? An extra man? This completely tips the balance in United's favor. But it does give us a chance to hit them on the counter. Yeah, if we can get back possession. And quickly, too. So, any ideas? You sure, dude? That sounds super risky. No risk. Last chance of the game. Will the goalie make the difference? Well, he seems to have Super Striker spooked. North and Block are finally marking United. And here's the run-up from Automatic. Oh! What a throw! What is Block doing? He sent the ball directly towards his own goal! What? Super Strikers planned that? <laughs> now that's risky. How fast can you run? Get back! Everyone, get back! I suppose that proves it. Defenders and forwards are soft. Goalkeepers are the most hardcore. <laughs> hey! What's so funny? So much for your three-step plan, Vince. I never said there were only three steps. <sighs> really? What's next? If you can't beat them, join them. Who is it? What do you want? Oh, uh, just 
just some ex students. Burger, burger! Hot shots! That move was the riskiest thing I have ever seen! So, you gonna take your own advice and stick to real header training? No risk, no reward, right? Yes. My thoughts exactly. <laughs> Welcome to header training! We're in the final few minutes at Strikerland, and the score is still tied. But Liquido makes another break for goal. And he's fast as ever, 18 miles an hour. But if there's one man who can keep up with him, it's Twisting Tiger. 19 miles an hour. 20 miles an hour for Laquido. 21 for Tiger. Cynical tackle from Laquido. But the ref says play on. Looks like you need a new lucky charm, bro. With Twisting Tiger on the ground, no one can catch Liquido. Goal! Oh. It's one nil to the visitors. And there's Liquido's signature shirt up celebration. Can you believe that guy? Yeah, Liquido totally fouled you, Tiger. Just wait till next game. You're gonna own him. Oh, please. If you think you're gonna get lucky at the floating stadium, you're wrong. I'm always faster at home. Voila! Hmm. Too much fat, too much sauce, and too much food. I need the guys lean and mean for the return leg. <laughs> I am Jacques Cousteau, creator of culinary intrigue. I am not here to help people diet. Sorry, Jacques. Extreme circumstances call for extreme preparation. Isn't that right, boys? <laughs> Whoa, this is awesome, coach. Uh, what are we doing in here? Rough? No. Oh, nah. Well, it's quite possible Hydro are the fastest team in the Super League because of their ingress to the greatest natural resistance training apparatus in the known universe. Um, uh, can you translate that for the average human? <laughs> and also for El Matador, please. Hydro train underwater. Exactly, Block. Water is a thousand times denser than air. Training in it will make playing on land seem like, well, actually running on air. <laughs> Okay, let's see if underwater training has made you any faster on land. Fastest first. Yeah, look out, Liquido. Tiger, you hit 24 miles per hour last game. Let's see if you can beat that. Gotcha, coach. 20... Six. Unbelievable. Dude. Oh, man. And... The longer you train in water, the faster you'll be. We leave for the floating stadium in three days. Uh, back in the tank? Back in the tank. Seven years at ship school. Nine years at Bistro Bazanto. Six Michelin stars for this. What is this? It's what I call rice limage. Rice on a bit of more rice in the shape of your face. <laughs> Come on, coach. We've trained underwater the whole week. Can't we have some real food? Your training will count for nothing if you aren't lean and mean, boys. Yeah, coach. We're lean and you're mean. How about a deal? If we beat Hydra, we get to have an awesome feast right here on the way home. So, what do you say, coach? 
<sighs> sure. Yeah! <laughs> You ready to lose again? Don't be so sure, dude. Yeah, been doing some underwater training of our own. What? Did you practice in the bathtub? We train in the ocean, right up until the game. That's why we're always faster at home. Tiger hit 28 miles an hour. Yeah, that's right. He'd beat you for pace anytime, any place. Oh yeah? How about right now? on the bottom of the ocean. What? I don't know about this, guys. Next level underwater training? A chance to show Liquido up? Come, Come on, on, dude! dude. <sighs> Fine. Compact breathing apparatus? Air lasts for ages. Comms device, built into your mask. Good for dissing. <gasps> Weight belt, stops you from floating back up to the surface. Helpful. have a choice. Been thrown in the deep end. You see anything? Too far down. Man, worst FOMO ever. Ready to be school. <laughs> faster. What are you think of that, Liquido? Huh? Liquido? <laughs> huh? See a match day, bro. No! Wait, Liquido! How do I get this belt off? With my lucky charm. Mwah! <laughs> Tiger? <gasps> yeah! You weigh a ton, <sighs> dude! How do you get this thing off? You can't! Liquido set me up. There's only one key, and he has it. Ugh, that sea snake! Yeah, what was I thinking? We gotta tell Coach. No, 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 no. Don't need to bother him, dude. We'll totally find the key. Hmm, I don't know. Come on, we got this. <sighs> Fine. <laughs> you have heard of the Super League, right? Now, low in fat, low in amoeba acids, and low in taste as well, I give you Super Legumes. Uh, beans? Yeah, beans. All worth it when we beat Hydra, boys. Any luck? <sighs> No sign of the key. Or Liquido. Tiger? Uh, Jock! So, how's the celebration menu coming along? It will be one of the finest meals I have ever made. And definitely the finest meal any of you have eaten. Really? Like, what are you thinking? Oh, 
how about hot dogs, Jacques? <laughs> of course. Yeah, yeah, you bet that was good dog. to me. I would rather make the diet food. Stupid faulty chair. Uh, what a weak chair, right? I know what's going on here. Tiger. You haven't been sticking to the diet, have you? Uh, busted, Tiger. <laughs> Get back on track, Tiger. We need you in top form tomorrow. <sighs> Too close. You guys said you'd get me out of this thing. Now do it. Telling coach. <sighs> aye, aye, aye. Uh, oh no! This is bad. Uh, you must really feel like you have the weight of the world on your shoulders. It isn't the weight of the world, it's Hydra's weight. Weren't you listening? <sighs> Sorry, guys. I've let everyone down. I was ready for this game and now I'm useless. <sighs> Coach, we'll do whatever it takes to sort this out. Correct. You two are getting the toughest job on the pitch. Twisting Tiger's job. You're marking Liquido. Tiger, just because you're on the bench doesn't mean we don't need you 100% focused on this game. Sure, Coach. First health food, now. <coughs> At dogs. I feel so ashamed. Hey, Mr. Chef, you open for business? <laughs> I am Jacques Cousteau. I serve kings, not peasants. Aw, oh, come on, dude. Game's about to start, and I gotta get my munch on. Yeah, we'll eat whatever. Prepare yourselves for the gourmet feast of a lifetime. Match day at the Floating Stadium. Oh boy, here we go, Brenda. Tiger versus Laquido, the battle of the speedsters. Uh, I don't think so, Mac. Uh, what is Coach thinking? He's put his fastest player on the bench. But, but, why? Super Strikers contain Liquido without twisting Tiger. Shakes immediately marks Liquido. But you don't need a speed tracker to know he's just not fast enough. Too soon, Brenda. Too soon. Now <laughs> North is on Liquido. Coach no. isn't giving Hydra an inch. Liquido's through on goal! But great last-ditch tackle from North Shaw. <laughs> this is a good start from Super Strikers. Shakes and North are making life tough for Liquido. I don't know if I can keep this up for 90 minutes. Maybe we don't have to. Follow my lead. Prepare to have your taste buds enlightened. Uh, you don't do hot dogs? You said you did anything I served. Yeah, but it's a soccer match, bud. You gotta make hot dogs. The hot dogs are for Super Strikers. If I give them to you, what would they eat? 
<laughs> Two dogs coming right up. We are well into the final third, and still no sign of Twisting Tiger. <laughs> Wow, Maquito, you are fast. Huh. Don't you know it? Pity you don't have a chance to prove you're the fastest. Huh? Well, Tiger did beat you on your underwater pitch. Uh, hello? I threw the underwater game? Sure you did, buddy. In a real race, I take Twisting Tiger any day. Oh, yeah? Prove it. <laughs> right. You want me to give you the key. Nice try. But this game ain't for pride. It's for points. Oh. Finally, Super Striker's two on one strategy has caved in. And here comes Liquido's shirt up celebration. Uh, or not. Huh? <gasps> How do I get this belt off? With my lucky charm. Coach, Liquido's signature celebration. He didn't do it. So? Really? Put me on and I'll find out. Can you even get close to Liquido with that belt on? One chance is all I need. <laughs> Hundreds of hot dogs, ready to roll! Delicious! Two for me, please! <laughs> Thanks, man! Gotta scram! Something big's happening! Good riddance to bad nourishment. Tell your friends, okay? Super Striker's substitution. Ah, finally! But it hasn't worked. <laughs> Guess we have final proof your charm isn't lucky, bro. You should worry about your own lucky charm. <gasps> what? Huh? Was Tiger wearing a white belt? But that means... You think underwater training makes you fast? It's nothing compared to weight belt training. Liquido shoots! Big Bo is beat! What? Looks like the tide may have turned. Dude, I thought you'd take Twisting Tiger any day. Ah. 29 miles an hour for Tiger! But Liquido is still on him, Max! No! The Super Striker Swinger has gone supersonic! 30 miles an hour! Hey, Liquido. See? My lucky charm always delivers. Hey, uh, do you think if I kissed that thing, I'd get more lucky? <coughs> well done, Tiger. That was some plan. Now, unless I'm mistaken, it's time to chow down on some epic hot dogs! Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> 
Get your hot dogs here! The finest hot dogs ever created! Hey! Isn't that our celebration meal? Now that's fast food. Jacques, what is going on here? I'm just giving the people what they want. And they wanted hot dogs! But what are we gonna eat? Finally, a five-star gourmet fist pit for Super League Kings. Bon appétit, Super Strikers. Uh, what is that? Uh. <laughs> Being the most refined of all of you, I love this gourmet food. Snails and fish eggs. Whoa! Coach, where are Tiger Shakes and Noah? Do you really think I'd let them join the feast after the stunt they pulled? Oh, shame. Poor guys. All right, Tiger! <laughs> uh, but how? They ran out so fast. Not as fast as me. <laughs> <laughs> Scores 2-0 to Super Strikers, and Big Bo's had nothing to do all game. Oh! Ah! Ah! Nakama are in Super Strikers' box! Woo! Ah, nothing to get excited about, Brenda. Block is there. But if he doesn't get this tackle right, it's a penalty for sure. Uh, huh? No problem for the big man. Block's the cleanest tackler in the Super League. You rock, Block! A turbo! Yeah! Yeah! Right, right on, man! Listen up, guys. The Robotics and Football Exhibition is coming up next week. Prof? Oh, uh, well, we thought we'd do something special this year, so I've made a robot. Of one of you. Huh? Hmm? Ah, must be Cool Joe. He does <laughs> the best robot. <laughs> it must be me. Why replicate anyone less good looking than the great El Matador? Introducing Roblox. Whoa! Whoa. Bravo, Whoa. Man. Wow. wow! Unbelievable. I need your clothes, your boots, and your shin guards. Tony, why does this tin can get to travel with the team? Cuz, unlike you lot, Chip T. Chuckerson is going to win me a prize. The game? Against Super Strikers? Oh. The other difference between Chip and you lot is he can actually learn things. Copy movie star. I need your clothes, your boots, and your shin guards. Um, I don't understand, Tony. He's gonna win me the robotics and football exhibit. Iron Tank are already the perfect robots. Ow! No foul, Cleon. No foul. And the Robotics, the robotics and Football, football grand, grand Prize goes to... to... Yes! Yes! Roblox! What? Block, hmm? a quick interview, perhaps? I can translate if you want. Been learning Brazilian. Tell me about your robot twin. <laughs> Physically, Roblox is a perfect copy of me. How could they give the award to the robotic dimwit? He's just a mindless replica. So, how's his football? <laughs> I don't know. Prof says playing against Roblox would be extremely dangerous because he's all steel and hydraulics. Oh, really? So what will he be doing at Strikerland? Welcome to Strikerland, home of the Super League's greatest team. Ah, a tour guide. So, who do you predict will win this weekend? Super Strikers or Technicali? I predict Super Strikers will prevail in our next game. Nice. 
Blah? Circle Blah, Circle Blah. Um, I'm only halfway through the Brislovian course. Uh, but if you ask me, Lena, I just need to score one goal, and Block will take care of the rest. Not if I take care of Block first. Copy, Block. Rogue, sir? <laughs> <laughs> now, if I can just figure out how to get your processor into that lumbering pile of nuts and bolts. Stop! First law of robotics, no water. Water will make you malfunction. But you have given me an idea. Technology from previous inventions. For example, I used the analytical algorithm from the magic Roblox eyes. Water! Get Roblox out of here! Go! Go, Chip! Go! exhibit has been locked down with all robots inside. No, no, no! There was so much he still had to see. Did you? Sure, that was one awesome robot block, Prof. In hindsight, it would have been difficult to make a robot as good looking as me. This sucks. Schmargelfleur. Clear all robot parts. Send those tin cans to the scrapyard. Yes, it worked. And by the time Super Strikers realize they're playing with a robot, half the team will be injured. <laughs> Let's put the robotics exhibit behind us, okay? I don't want it affecting our performance against Technicali. Now, get to it. El Matador? Uh... My preparation will be purely mental, Coach. Reminding myself how awesomely amazing I am. <sighs> hey, Block. I reckon the best practice I can get is against the world's best defender. my foot off. What's up with you? You seem different. I think I'll do some training where I won't end up in hospital. Oh! These super strikers are too fast and skilled to be injured by Roblox. Hmm? But my players aren't. John J. Johnson Jr. Hi, Tony! I've come up with a strategy for you. Great. Let's hear it. Dribbling. Ah, uh, again? I thought the doctor cleared that up. He means dribbling a soccer ball. I want you to dribble straight at block, John J. Johnson Jr. Isn't that kind of risky? With Roblox on the pitch, there'll be cards for Super Strikers and penalty kicks for Technicali. <sighs> I am Roblox. The robot block. The true legend is over there. Danger! 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 Danger. <laughs> Welcome to Striker Land, home of the Super League Trophy. Let's begin our tour. Circle. Okay, boys, let's call it for today. Be the block. What's up with you? You seem different. Hey, block. You coming? Sure, lad.
Something's up with Block. He's playing weird, speaking weird. Shaw shakes, dude. It's not like you're an authority on Brislovian. Yeah, brother. Aren't you still learning? <laughs> Cassette tape? Yeah. Latest technology in Breslovia. <laughs> <laughs> Gerbil, Zerk, Glarg, Bzork. Now you say it. Gerbil, Zerk, Glarg, Bzork. Yep, I know that one. Next up, Zerk, Lagerb, Blurgle, Strazer. Blurgle, Strazer. Hey! <sighs> okay, tape six. Huh? Weird. Where are six to nine? Are you ready for the final level of Learn Brislovian? Here we go. Rarl clad zuzangle crad blook to rasbrico. Got it. Huh. If my Brislovian isn't dodgy, then what's up with block? Next up, Zorg Blang Berserkle Bar. Tapes! Block the rug! Block! One of our main values at Strike a Land is determination. It's much day at the fight club. No matter where you are, whatever you're doing, it's a fantastic day for a bit of football. Super Strikers have been looking good, but Chuck T. Chipperson is in great form. Block will need to be on top of his game, Mac. I'm sure he will, but uh, he's so reliable. Always there when Super Strikers need him. <laughs> Block, we need to talk. Purple. Zergle Purple Gerb? The rather Grinlock, to Colonel for Boombra. He says he's been under a lot of pressure lately. Wow, Chicks, your Brislovian has really improved. Yeah, totally. <laughs> <laughs> Block, I know something's wrong. Your game, your Brislovian, it's like you're a different person. Kirkserblogger, rob the goal. Excuse me? Kirkserblogger, rob the goal. You took my tapes. But why would you need to learn Brislovian? <laughs> because you're not Block. You're Roblox. You can't go out there. You, you can't play. You'll hurt people. Roblox, listen to me! Please remember to look after your belongings during the tour. And last out, last week's man of the match, Block! Oh, no! He's a machine, Brenda. But where's Shake? Aye. I thought we had a first choice 11 on both sides. Klaus, warm up. Eagle Eye, Grizz, get shakes. Oh, uh, what's the strategy again? Uh, you run straight at block. Oh, right. striker to do business with Block. <laughs> wow. So unlike Block. Yes! <laughs> I mean, what was that? Whatever happened to fair play? Keep it tidy, Block. Another one, and the card's coming out. Shakes! Shakes! I don't get it. Where did he go? Unbelievable scenes here at Strike-A-Land. Locke's gone for 
from gentle giant to belligerent brute. <laughs> oh, the ref is reaching into his pocket and... It's a yellow card! He's ruining his hard-earned reputation in a single game. Please stay near. Do you need the restroom? It's down the stairs. First left, second right, immediate right, and straight ahead. Next up, the Strike Lounge Ball. Isn't it total luxury? Well, folks, all good things must come to an end. More? Follow me for the final part of our exciting tour. And it gets worse. The big defender. Penalty huh? to technicality. Lock best clean up his act soon, or he'll be sent off. Fasten your seatbelts, because the final stop on our tour is the Strike Land Garage. Technicali go one ahead. All thanks to a surprisingly poor performance from Block. Who would have thought? First a missing striker. Now a defender whose brain's gone missing? North. Uh, uh, Shakes? Don't let anyone know I've been here. That's not Block. It's Roblox. Yeah, and I always take advice from dudes hiding in lockers. He put me in here. He finds out you're onto him and you're next. You need to get him out of here. Block, what is wrong with you? Burger Blogger, grab the boom. Oh, I know this one. Block's uh, hitting the showers. Right, Block? Since when do you speak Breslovian? I've been taking night classes. That isn't Block. It's Roblox. Hmm. Yeah, right. The dangerous tackling, weird Brislovian, cold, steely demeanor? Well, we're about to find out if I'm right. Why is that, Shakes? Robots don't take showers. <laughs> So if that's Roblox, where's Blob? <laughs> Super Strikers drive only the coolest vehicles. Well, there's our tour guide. Someone switched the robot's processors. Shakes, you were right, dude. But where is Block? <laughs> He says we've got to go on for the second half, or we'll forfeit the game. Muggle Blah. Don't worry, he's got this. Can't wait for him any longer. Huh? huh? They didn't sub him? Looks like your work isn't done, John J. Johnson Jr. Block! Uh, you did it! Uh, I think. The second half is about to start, and Super Strikers have a lot of work to do. Well, Coach should have started by subbing Block. He's the reason they're losing. Ooh! Block's gonna finish John J. Johnson Jr. once and for all! And get what he deserves, a red card. Like it, vintage block. Smooth, slick, and effective. 
invention. Oh, I'm too clever. My invention has learned to play like the best defender in the league. <laughs> Sorry, Tony. You're wrong. No one can play like the block. Lago Zerto! Lago Zerto! No, no, no! no! Whatever was troubling Block in the first half is ancient history. Nice one, brother! <laughs> Block, you did it! And where is your very scary twin? But how could a bomb? So I'm hanging from Strike the Land, Roblox about to ditch me, when suddenly I remember something. How could we not, Block? My new robot friend. And now for the final part of our tour. Ta-da! Uh, uh, I need to close Smaggle Club. Copy. Rob Eh, I think Prof should just make a robot that looks like me next time. But how do we know we aren't all robots already? Ow! Oh! Come on. Uh, yeah, uh, come on. Uh. He's through the Nakama midfield, last chance before full time. He's through the Nakama midfield, last chance before full time. Shakes, aren't you bored of that game yet? Yeah, you clock it like every time you play. I don't know why you play that thing at all, brother. Why would you want to play fake football when you're going to jam the real thing against Nakama tomorrow? <laughs> Super League 3000X is just like real soccer, Cool Joe. Sorry, Shakes. Games just don't impress me. The ball gets away from him. Missed opportunity. The ball gets away from him. Missed opportunity. Ah. You lose. <laughs> mm. It is kind of dated. But apparently the new version is going to be so good. Amazing graphics and super realistic sound effects. <gasps> oh, yeah. Ooh. And the world's best players. Coming soon. Super League 4000X. Woohoo! Yeah! Wow! Whoa! Super Strikers! Oh, big XP feeling totally nerfed right now. <laughs> I'm Alex. I'm gonna motion capture your moves for SL 4000X. Hi, Alex. I'm Shakes. Uber, cool. You want? Um, it's Shakes, not Uber. Uh, Uber's from Iron Tank. Uh, it's an expression. Ah, saws. Uh, uh, I mean, sorry. Sometimes I forget how people speak out there. You ready for the grand tour? Huh? <laughs> Yo, 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 it's Uncool Joe. Phew, is that a funny smell or is it just a ping pong? Table tennis to you, sucker. Uh, so I'm guessing you know each other? Hey guys, meet Chill John, world's number one ping pong player. Table tennis? Everything he knows about, well, everything really, he borrowed from yours truly. Police! I'm past those beginner techniques, sucker. I am the new king of spin. Your style is still cool, Joe. Your spin is thin. Huh. <clears throat> Tour starting. You guys coming? First up, it's the coders. Super intelligent brainiacs who build the games. The testers basically play games and eat chocolate the whole day. <laughs> cool. Where do I sign up? Here we have the sound studio. Real Super League players and coaches are contributing their voices to SL4000X. Yeah, good call. The sound effects in 3000 kind of sucked. Game over. You lose! 
Game over. You lose. <laughs> Okay, okay, we're, we're getting there. Can you make it feel more summery, more sunny? What? This isn't the weather report. Don't worry. We're almost there. Take 346. Go. Uh, I give up. And finally, where the real magic happens. Super Strikers? The Motion Capture Studio is where we capture every detail of your moves. Every detail, hey? <laughs> yes, yes, genius, fantastic! Do it again, but into the microphone this time, yeah? <sighs> Welcome to the Motion Capture Studio. The position and movement of the sensors on your suits are recorded by special cameras, and the data is input into this computer. All right. Oh, I read. <laughs> oh, please, Alex. Don't be motion capturing this, okay? <laughs> Don't worry. The only thing I want to capture is all the classic Super Strikers moves. times I gotta tell you guys, video games just ain't my thing. But the game won't be the same without the four pillars of spin. I don't know, brother. <sighs> Come on. All right, all right, I'll do it. <laughs> hey, what do you think you're doing? I, uh, um... It's not Cosplay Friday, is it? No. Oh, I feel like such a fool. Don't. You're rocking that look. Great costume. Uh, thanks. Hey, why don't we swap? Really? Really. Like, really, really? Really, really. Like, really! Get ready for the four pillars of spin. Left spin. Right spin. Back spin. How does he spin the ball like that? Unbelievable. Can't wait to see this stuff in gameplay. <laughs> Top spin. I got this one, I got this one. Uh, okay, you can have this one. Thanks, sister. And how do you guys know where the ball's gonna go? Practice makes perfect. Ugh, more like practice and practice and practice makes perfect. SL4000X is gonna rock! You guys have been so much help! Yes. You've been so much help, Super Strikers. And there you have it. Cool Joe's four pillars of spin. Know them, spot them, intercept them. It will always be one of four. This is going to make Super Striker's head spin. <laughs> huh? Now I get the laugh right. It's Nakama versus Super Strikers live from Gashuku Stadium. These two famous rivals are equally matched. But if one player can make the difference, it's Cool Joe. The Crossing King! There's the cross. Shakes and El Matador are there. Can one of them get a touch? Ooh. 
What? Ooh, well read by Miko Chen. <laughs> Looks like Cool Joe just needs to kick to me next time. Yes? Hmm. Super Slakers fight to the group. But it's no use. Oh! Nakama take the first game. Seems the Crossing King has been dethroned. You lose, Super Strikers. <laughs> game over. You lose. <laughs> Uh, Cool Joe? What? I think I know why Nakama can read your four spins. Oh, really? How? Urigiri was at the mocap studio yesterday. <laughs> Rewind there, brother. Urigiri was where? I'm sorry. I think he saw your moves. What did I tell you? All that digital juju, no emotion capture wireless pfft, is no good, brother. Hey! Cool Joe, hey, you need to think about what happens to my ego when I'm not scoring goals, man. And don't be so selfish, okay? Thanks for coming by. We're totally gonna get our revenge in the return match. How, Shakes? Urigiri saw all my moves. The four pillars of spin ain't secret anymore. Hey, look on the bright side, Cool Joe. It can't get any worse. <clears throat> yo, 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 yo. Don't worry. I already signed this one for ya. Paddle power? I saw Nakama shut you down, Cool Joe. Told you I'm the new king of spin. But don't worry. Maybe you can learn a thing or two from my game. I got speed you can't even imagine. Ah! <laughs> you like game shakes? Why not play ping pong till the new Super League game comes out? Table tennis, fool! Spin you can't even imagine, huh? Your spin is thin. Level 10, sucker. Not bad. Level 24, are you the next speed master? Level 36, you got some moves. I knew I could do it. Oh. I gotta find Chill John. Oh, come on, Shakes. At least wash your hands. Thanks for the help, Alex. It's the least I can do after my noob mistake with a mocap. This is the place. But I don't know how we're gonna get in, especially considering you're friends with Cool Joe. Undercover, of course. Don't want to give the game away. Uh, didn't we already do that? Joe can beat the karma. So, who's next? Who wants 
to play the king of spin. <laughs> Shakes, what are you doing here? I'm here about the corkscrew. Seriously, Cool Joe, there is a fifth spin. And I know how you can learn it. Please, Shakes. I've already learned my lesson. Why would I take your advice ever again? Listen to him, Cool Joe. Yeah, come on. We need you out there. Or I might not score any goals. Whatever. All Shakes has done the last few days is play Paddle Power. Yeah, that's kind of how I found out about the fifth spin. Video games? Table tennis? Chill John? These are a few of my least favorite things. The fifth spin exists. I developed it. Hm. I'll believe it when I see it. Huh. To help you learn the corkscrew extra fast, we're gonna mocap it and analyze it. Just like Uragiri did with your moves. I guess if video games got us into this mess, video games can get us out. Uh, there's one other thing. Just like in Paddle Power, the corkscrew has to be unlocked. Really? I want to prove once and for all who's the best spinner of them all. Like I said, I don't play the pawn. Table tennis! Uh, need goals, Cool Joe. <laughs> Do it for me. And the team also. All you have to do is get one point off him. Match day at Strikerland! Last week we saw these two teams aren't as evenly matched as they once were, Brenda. So, Coach has made a big change. Klaus is on the left wing and Cool Joe is nowhere to be seen. crosses make scoring easy. No, they don't. Okay, maybe they do a little. Don't worry, guys. I'm sure Cool Joe got that point by now. Uh. <sighs> yo, yo, guy plays like a total badger. Come on, you scoundrel. Let him beat you. Just one point. No way, El Matador. I want to win fair and square. Oh, this is not the time for honor, Cool Joe. Forget your pride. Abandon your principles, man. No way. I have to embrace my principles. I'm no gamer like Shakes. I can't play table tennis like Chill John. I'm a footballer. Run, Run, Cool Joe. You can do it, Mom. You can do it. Wicked mind. <laughs> 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 the facts don't lie, Chill John. The number one spinner mm -hmm. is always the winner. You are a legend. Oh, yes. Oh, what a rally. Foot table tennis? Come on. Deal's a deal, brother. The second half is underway. Fantastic news for Super Strikers. Looks like Cool Joe's on the field and immediately into the action. Woohoo! Go, Cool Joe! 
Even if Cool Joe can pull off the corkscrew, how do we know where it's gonna go? No practice and practice and practice, right? Yeah. And from what I've seen, the corkscrew has a mind of its own. What's the use, Cool Joe? We know all your spins. All right, this is it. Fifth spin coming up. I hope. One of four. It's sailing into the danger area. But it's gone past everyone. Oh yeah! The number one spinner is always the winner! <sighs> I lose! Nice! Like dusk. We're keeping that one. <sighs> Oh, man, SL4000X is beyond awesome. Got you again, Urigiri. <sighs> I lose! <laughs> 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 Hey guys, yo, 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 yo. Aw, oh, Shakes, you still playing that old school SL4000X game? We're jamming our new hybrid Paddle Power versus Super League game. Spinner takes all. I just got it delivered from Alex. <laughs> Looks cool. Can I try? No way, man. I've only got to like level 41. In time, brother. In time. <laughs> to the final few minutes at the cauldron. Super Strikers are throwing everyone forward. They're desperate to find the Equalizer. But Grimm's ghoulish defense is holding firm. If anyone can break through, it's El Matador. Super Strikers number 20 has done everything right today. Everything except score a goal, that is. Precision through ball from Dancing Rasta. Shakes draws the defense. It's an open goal! was so busy celebrating, he didn't bother to check if the pool went in. Oh, this is not going to be good for his confidence. It's over for me. Goodbye forever, soccer. Suck it up, bro. We all have a bad game now and then. Ah, you guys don't get it. I'm not special anymore. I'm just a regular player. Like the rest of you. Uh -huh. uh, read some fan mail, dude. That'll cheer you up. Okay, man. I'll get onto that pronto. We'll see you at training, right? Yeah, yeah. See you there. De Los Santos. How confident are you feeling ahead of Azul's trip to Strikerland? Stopping Super Striker's attack is always a challenge, Lena. Ah! But I am feeling up to the job. <laughs> <laughs> ah, show off. Well, he does have the stats to back the confidence. That's why we'll be playing with three Strikers. Shakes, Klaus, and... Uh... Where is El Mando? Yeah, where this is, is I haven't seen him. He had better have a good reason. Hello, you've reached El Matador. I will be unavailable forever. Oh, still this? Don't leave a message, and I won't get back to you. Goodbye. Still down about that miss, eh? Yep, moping at home. Huh. Well, there goes our three striker strategy, brothers. Hmm. Jakes, Klaus, come with me. I have a plan. 
El Matador's confidence has taken a major hit. I'm counting on you to get his mind right before the Azul game. I don't know, coach. It's gonna take something big to get through to him. Welcome to our Football Technology Vault. I always wondered where you kept this stuff, Coach. So, we put on the robo suit, grab El Matador, and bring him back, right? <laughs> Not quite. Activate Narcissus Protocol. had a state-of-the-art device created especially for this kind of situation. Ooh, what does it do? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Just find El Matador, press the button, and the device will do the rest. El Matador! Anyone home? And I thought my place was untidy. Dear El Matador the Great, forget what everyone else says, that miss wasn't your fault. It was obviously a bad pass from Shakes. Hmm. Come join your real fans. We believe in you no matter what. He wouldn't have. He, he, he couldn't have. His hair dryer isn't here. He never goes anywhere without it. Oh, he did. I don't know, coach. He's somewhere in the middle of nowhere. Don't worry, we'll get him back. Ooh, I can't wait to see what this baby does. Forget about the device, Klaus. We need to focus on getting El Matador back in time for the game. Hmm. It could be a fold-up helicopter. <gasps> or a hypnosis device. <gasps> Maybe it's a teleporter. A flux capacitor? A spaceship for ants? The world's smallest spotlight? A robotic homing pigeon? A Rubik's sphere? A gravity disruptor? VR projector? A trans-dimensional day spa? A silver snitch? A bright destroy? A pokeball? Portable universe? Alien egg? Self-aware magic eight ball? <gasps> I have to know! <laughs> Must find out what it does. Oh! <laughs> ah! <gasps> Too close. Shakes is right. I have to focus on getting El Matador back in time. Back in time. <gasps> Klaus, we're here. Hmm? God, where did he go? <laughs> well, this is definitely the place. There's something fishy going on in there, Junior. Um, I'm looking for a friend. Uh, glasses, ponytail... There are many on board, but only one. Right. <laughs> Thanks. Watch out, Junior. Everyone in there is crazy. Last stop. Everybody off. Ugh. Get El Matador back in time. <gasps> the question isn't where am I, but when am I? Of course, a time machine. I 
to find El Matador, but this is ridiculous. What? Okay, Shakes, activate the device and get El Matador out of here. Easy as... Klaus? Mm. Do not be alarmed by my strange clothes and futuristic haircut. I am a time traveler. Oh, great. Another crazy. I don't see anyone else here. First the ponytail guy, then the cheeky one with the spiky hair. The ponytail guy? Yes, the perfect place to get away from yourself, the past. Very clever, El Matador. Uh, where or when did the ponytail guy go? Rejoice! Our king is here! Feel the duty! Feel the duty! <laughs> Almost. It's feel the beauty! Duty! Beauty! Duty? Eh, close enough. See? We are your best fans! Huh? The shame! Ooh. Look! Ooh. He mocks the great one with this incorrect jersey number! What? This the only one in the shop. Mm. Come on, people. <laughs> Feel the duty? He's not worthy of the mighty El Matador. No. No. the team! No. 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 Fine. I didn't even want to be part of your stupid club anyway. Sheesh. Those people won't let me anywhere near El Matador. <sighs> Our king is bored and demands entertainment. Who will step up for the skills battle? Winner will be given one-on-one -on -one face time with El Matador himself. Yeah. Gotcha. My shirt! My glasses! My pants! My dignity! <laughs> to any other's challenge for an audience with the king. I do. Huh? <gasps> <laughs> there is only one explanation for this. All the El Matadors from every point in time have gathered here. But I need the real El Matador. Good luck, challengers! This guy knows his stuff. Uh, He's not one of us. Shakes, what are you doing here? You have to come back to strike a land, El Matador. We need three strikers to get past De Los Santos. Uh, I'm sorry, Shakes. My place is here now. My people need me. But Super Strikers are your people. Unworthy! Off the team! El Matador, come on! Please! El Matador! I'm sorry, my friend, but this is best. For me and for Super Strikers. This one is big trouble. I don't want him coming back. <laughs> Let me out! Let me out! Let me... <sighs> Thank goodness. Where did you go? I think you mean when did I go? Huh? What are you talking about? Well, it's obvious that El Matador is hiding in the past. That's why Coach gave us the time machine.
That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Oh, really? Well, what's your big theory then, Shakes? El Matador started a weird fan club consisting entirely of El Matador lookalikes and plans to rule them like a king. That's the stupidest thing I've ever heard. Look, Matt, who they are or when they are isn't important. What matters is that we get El Matador back. Well, what are we waiting for? Or Raza? Don't say it, dude. When are we waiting for? All right, people, one more time. From the top, feel the beauty. Feel the beauty. Uh, I give up. Hey, El Matador. Oh, feel the duty? We are here to take our El Matador back to the present and the future. Or is that back to the future which was the present? Huh? Get them! Let's find out what this thing really does. If you're watching this, you're in trouble. We all feel lost from time to time. Perhaps you have lost the keys to your Lamborghini. You might have lost your thoughts. It's friend. not a time machine? That happened. <laughs> Brilliant. The Maybe only person El Matador listens to is himself, I mean, so Coach made an El Matador hologram to convince him to come back. Well, no it way. seems to be working on all of them. Or you're lost contemplating your own beauty. Perhaps you are lost in time, lost in space, and me. But remember, you are the greatest player of the age. Super Strikers need you because, like a Lamborghini, without the key, they just aren't as good. Come on. Come on. I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to. Oh, crazy! You need to fulfill your destiny at Strike Alive. Help me, El Matador. I am my only hope. You heard the glorious ponytailed leader? Super Strikers need us! Yeah! Yeah! Striker Man! Striker Man! Yeah! Hmm. You may have got me back to Striker Land, but I'm not playing. Hmm. hmm. You did use the hologram, right? It should have worked. We used it all right. Just not how you intended. What are you talking about? Uh, you wouldn't believe me if I told you? The Azul fans are looking confident today, folks. Well, I would too if I had the mighty De Los Santos in goal. Odd, though, that coaches opted to keep El Matador on the bench. Yeah, tough to see Super Strike is getting past Azul's keeper without it. Chance for Super Strikers. What a shot! But not enough to beat De Los Santos. Fun warm up. <laughs> when are we gonna start playing for real? Shakes and Klaus are giving it their all. But it's not enough. De Los Santos is just too good. I have an idea. It's an oldie, but a goodie. We're almost at the end of the first half. Can Shakes and Klaus finally get past De Los Santos? Shakes hits the post! And the ball goes straight to Klaus! Oh! Huh? Come on, Shakes. You beat me with that trick before. It's going to take much more than that to beat me again. Oh. Hate to say it, Coach, but this isn't working. Yeah, we need three strikers out there. We need El Mar Don't even say his name. I don't want to see any more of that guy. Reporting for duty, coach. Uh, yeah, 
we may have accidentally played the hologram message to a bunch of crazy El Matador fans. <gasps> That's it. I'm calling security. Coach, hang on a minute. I think there's a way we can use this. My people! I knew you'd come to get me. And that's not the only good news. Really? Yeah, we found your replacement. <laughs> I always knew I had it in me to be the best El Matador ever. That's what you wanted, right? No, 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 coach. These are just fans who adore Wonderful. me. Wonderful. With you on board, <laughs> De Los Santos has no chance. Hey, why don't we give Mel Matador's locker? Oh, perfect! We even have the same number! Yeah, sounds yeah, good, good to me. Buck. Unless you mind, El Matador. No, not at all. Oh, in that case, we can give him your hair dryer too, right? He is the one on the pitch, man. His hair needs to look better than yours. <laughs> That's it! There are plenty of people who look like me, but there is only one El Matador. Prove it. Huh? I'll put you on, but if you don't produce the goods, I'm going to replace you with the El Matador who really wants to be here today. Me, 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 me. Come on, my people. Let's go and beat the Azul. Let's do this. All right. <laughs> yeah. Halftime substitution for the Super Slakers. Coach brings on El Matador. We're well into the second half. Scores are tight, and Super Strikers are on the attack again. But this time, they've <laughs> unleashed their full firepower. Brilliant build-up play. But it doesn't count for a thing if they can't get it past De Los Santos. Klaus shoots. De Los Santos saves. She latches onto the rebound. De Los Santos saves again. But, but here, here comes El Matador. Oh, oh, oh. What a completely unorthodox move from El Matador. And he's back. Feel the beauty. <laughs> El Matador really is one of a kind. Yes, yes. Come on, come on, huh? Oh, forget it! I'll get my fish from the supermarket. You think you're going to be able to handle this, Shakes? Yeah. I've been working on a killer new move. The only thing you're going to hear from the Sultans fans is, No! How does Shakes do it? Ah! And what about you, Spenza? It's going to be difficult to chant louder than them. Ha! You're talking to a super fan, son. We're the loudest in the business. Ooh! Nico's in a promising position. 
because she wants the whole fans to make even more noise. That's even possible. We've got a lot of work to do. Miko, what happened out there, dude? We were ready, prepared, but that sound. Come on, brother. You've played plenty of mega stadiums before. You cannot understand it until you are out there. Hmm. I've never seen Miko that spooked by, well, anything. That's why we're doing extra preparation to handle the Sultan's fans. Prof? You may be used to lifting uh, dumbbells, but today you will have to contend with decibels. What? Exactly. Decibels and watts are both ways to measure loudness. The first challenge when playing in front of a noisy crowd is communication. I've developed a series of uh, hand gestures to use on the pitch. Learn them all. Sure thing. Or rather... Your budgie has toothache? Uh, perhaps I need a little more time to learn them. All right, superfans! Our mission... The Goliath! 200 restaurants, 130 shops, movie theaters, arcades, ice rink, petting zoo! I can't promise all of you will make Spencer! it loud! Super friend! <laughs> uh, just getting the crew G'd up for the Sultan's game. Let's focus on out singing the Sultan's fans, not out shopping them, yeah? <laughs> All right, guys. I've got some awesome new chants to try out. But first, warm ups. One, two, three! <gasps> okay, boys. You've learned the hand signals. Some of you have learned the hand signals. The second challenge when playing in front of a massive crowd is how you handle the noise. Come on, coach. The fans don't make that much difference. Pros like us have perfect concentration. What are we talking about again? According to my calculations, this should be... A perfect simulation of the Goliath! His new move. Is a hostile environment like the Goliath really the best place to try a new technique? Let's find out. What was that? We didn't even wake up Sandra. Again! And this time, make it count. Strikers, welcome to the Goliath. I have no doubt it will overwhelm you with its facilities. Food, clothes, accessories, cinemas, an ice rink, a petting zoo. Goliath has everything you could possibly want. And you, as my guests, can access it all with your very own personal GoPass. Whoa, thanks, oh, oh, thanks. Very kind of you, Sheik. 
But the only thing we have time for right now is football. You taught him the hand gestures? The stadium is full of spiders? We gotta get out of here! Never mind. So, what do you think of the Goliath? Dude! I wanna live here! So many awesome things to check out! Well, this all-access go-pass might help. <gasps> I will only use this mighty tool for the power of good! And maybe some snacks. It's go time! <laughs> at Goliath Stadium. Then I have to say, Super Strikers are looking cool as ice. Say it! You have to shout it in this stadium! All right, guys, let's show these Sultans fans how it's done. One, two, three! Super Strikers rule the pitch and we control the stands! Goliath cheers from had a chance against the Super Fans! <laughs> Where are you? Ah, oh, go pass. How I love thee. Oh, man, I gotta get field side. But I'm not gonna last 90 minutes. It's go time. Super Strikers look to assert themselves early on. And so do their fans. You might as well admit to beat the balls and dance and cross the street. He's making shapes. And when he shoots, I don't know what happened. I had that move down. Playing in front of all these fans is totally different to training. Maybe keep it simple next time, Shake Smart. Yeah, give the ball to the player with the perfect... Uh, concentration? That's the stuff. <laughs> ah, much better. <gasps> but I'm so late. Friend's gonna be mad. Shortcut! <laughs> Go time! Huh? Hey, I thought this thing was all access! The home support blunted Super Striker's attack! Now, can they help Sultans take the lead? <laughs> Not if North Shaw can help it. Yeah, go to the south or the east or the west, but if you head north, you'll be dispossessed. Wow, the Super Strikers fans are really doing their part. But there's nothing compared to this whole crowd. It's like Sultans have a 12th player on the pitch. What are you doing here? What indeed? 
This area is off limits to to everyone. Everyone. Uh, go pass. <laughs> and don't come back. Ever. Ever. Wow, pretty decisive first half, eh, Brenda? Yep. The team with the most fans wins. Miko was right. You really don't know what it's like till you're out there. I don't know, guys. There's something weird about that noise. That sounded like a million people, not 150,000. Yeah, uh, where are they hiding, Shakes? The ice rink or oh, the petting zoo? Go passes. Uh, don't actually have mine on me. The go pass is the only way to access restricted areas. Hmm. <laughs> huh? Oh, man! Spencer! Oh. Half time? Where were you? Uh, not sure exactly. This place is big. Endless corridors. Bottomless sodas. I'm sorry. I haven't been much of a super fan. But I promise to give 120% in the second half. Huh? Shakes? There's old yogurt in my tog bag. Go fetch the itching powder. You say potato, I say potato. I've got it. Something weird's going on here. Use the go pass to investigate. Come on, friend. It's go time. Spencer, stop. What about your promise? Super Strikers need us now more than ever. Fran, being a super fan isn't just about what's in here or here. It's about what's going on in there. Okay, fine. Spenza PI, let's investigate. Hmm, but we need a way to get past those grouchy scientist peeps. Go time. Working. Uh, uh, and it was then that I realized E must equal MC squared. Yeah, happens to me all the time. Rebooting machine for second half. Power okay. Amplifiers warming up. One hundred and fifty thousand fans weren't enough, so the Sheik added a few million decibels right underneath the pitch. <laughs> no wonder Super Strikers can't handle the noise. We gotta shut this thing down somehow. I think I know how. You mean? It's go time. Game's about to restart. Let's see if Super Strikers can make more of an impression in the second half. Uh, unlikely, Mac. Just when you thought it couldn't get any worse for the men in red, their fans desert them. Shakes, what did you say to Spenza? Whatever it was, I don't think he understood the hand signals. No goals and no fans. Can things get any worse for Super Strikers? There's the signal. That's a go, people. Super fans. Let's do this. Perhaps all Super League teams should build.
build themselves a bigger stadium, Mac. Hey, scientist peeps! You can't be in here! This area is off limits! We're not going anywhere till we shut down that machine! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Our decibel generator is made from titanium alloy. Titanium? It's practically indestructible. Practically. But we already know it's one weakness. Every machine's weakness. <laughs> Super fans! One, two, three! The Sultan's chanting, it just disappeared. I know, what happened? They did. Even I know that hand signal. Come on guys, let's win this for the fans. <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Now, how about the classic? Count us in, Spence. One, two, three, four. Super Striker! Super Striker! Super Striker! Super Striker! Super Striker! Remember, Six, content! Ah, oh, never mind, just scored the goal! Super Striker! Super Striker! Hard luck, Shay. Yeah, I heard you had a sound strategy. Pity it fizzed out. <clears throat> <sighs> Thanks. And I have something for you, Shakes. Uh, what's this? Your go pass bill. Okay, the bus is leaving. Gotta go. What? Who buys a hundred and thirty sodas? Superstriker's ace goal scorer Shakes returns to training after he's a rip. All right. I'm ready. Shakes, Shakes amigo! Shakes. We're totally apt to have our star striker back, dude! But El Matador didn't go anywhere. Thanks, guys. 
I can't wait to score some goals. It's been way too long. Uh, you do know who we're facing next, right? <coughs> hmm. Well, you don't need to worry about getting injured again, Shakes. Presenting the ultimate in soccer safety equipment. An airbag for your shins. I need someone to kick me. I'll do it, Klaus. <laughs> See? I am completely a ninja. Uh, <laughs> Ouch. What do you got for me, coach? Shakes, we, we need, need to, to test, test your, your match, match readiness, readiness before, before you rejoin, rejoin the first team. Match readiness test initiated. You're sure we aren't being a little tough on the guy, Coach? If he can't take this, there's no way he'll handle Iron Tank. Match readiness rating, 25%. 50%. 75%. The moment of truth. Watch out, man! Match readiness test aborted. <sighs> you called it, Coach Man. His physical injury is healed, but the emotional scar remains. You gotta be kidding me, Coach! You honestly expect me to just sit and watch while the guys battle Iron Tank? Of course not. I have an important solo mission for you. Super Strikers, we write to you in a time of desperate need. Only you can help us open our brand new mall? It doesn't have to be a mall opening. Movie premieres, theme parks, old age homes, take your pick. I don't want to make celebrity appearances. I want to take on Uber. You're not ready. Pick any event you want. Go anywhere in the world. But get your mind off Iron Tank. Video games on the state of the art tracking screen! Oh, sir. Sir. Sorry, sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Get back to work, you lazy dogs! Now, what is it you want to show me? Super Strikers have left for the Fortress Stadium. But Shakes is heading for China. Hmm. Suspicious. Keep me informed of all his movements. Well, sure beats them all opening. Welcome to the Yellow Emperor's Palace, official home of the History of Football Museum. Uh, thanks? Oh, sorry. Tour guide mode. Force of habit. I'm Xing. Come on, let me show you around. The museum features soccer from throughout history. That's mob football from 16th century England. Any number of players, no rules. Invincible United are playing in the wrong century. The ancient Greek game of Episkiros was more like modern soccer, with one big exception. Players could use their hands. Yeah, and they didn't wear pants. This is all very impressive, but why'd you guys need me here? You're gonna be the guest of honor at the unveiling of our new exhibit. You get to cut the ribbon. <laughs> all part of the service when you call Soccer Stars for Hire. So, can I get a sneak peek? Sorry, no one's allowed to see the exhibit before the grand unveiling. I suppose I can make an exception for shakes from Super Strikers. What is that? Football's oldest known predecessor, Kuju. Players had to keep control of a ball while fighting off crazy kung fu attacks. This tapestry tells the legend of a teenager who single-handedly defeated a whole team of soldiers. Man. This is too cool. Huh. You ain't 
ain't seen nothing yet. Come on! Welcome to the Yellow Emperor's Training Arena. Whoa! Kuju was the Super League of ancient China, and the Emperor wanted to make sure his team was the best. So, he built this place. <laughs> Sounds like Coach. I could show you some Kuju moves if you want, you know. To use against Uber if he tries to injure you again. Thanks, but, uh, Coach dropped me for the Iron Tank game. No ways. He doesn't think I'm ready to face Uber. Well, what better way to prove that you are than busting out some Kuju moves? No offense, but if I was going up against Iron Tank, I'd need to learn from a master. You know, long beard, flowing robes, in riddles does speak. Status report! Thor is about to break the club record! Not the game! Shakes! Sir, Shakes is under the history of football museum. I knew he was up to something. Iron Tank? Get ready to die! All right, then. Show me some of these Kuju moves, Master. Everything you need to learn is here. No! Ah! What are you doing? Come on! Pick up the pace. If you can't dodge me, how are you gonna dodge a whole team of muscle freaks? Sorry, Shakes. Training is cancelled. What are you doing here? <clears throat> I was wondering the same about you, Shakes. But now I see what you're up to. You plan to use this fighting football against us. Uber, you stalker creep. I'm not even playing against you. Coach left me off the team. Yeah, sure. You can't lie to a master strategist like me. I know your every move before you make it. Bet you didn't see that move coming, Master Strategist. Get her! She will teach us the Kuju! Hey! Let go of me, Walrus! Leave her out of this! Or what? So. Coach was right. I'm not ready. A teenager defeated a whole team of soldiers. Faster! Faster! Iron Tank will try to break your rhythm and dent your confidence. Uh, coach, that's not the only thing they'll try to break and dent. That's why you need to pick up the pace. If they can't catch you, they can't foul you. 
We don't need to worry about that anymore, Coach. I've got a new safety invention, the Slippery Spray. Someone kick me. <sighs> this again. <laughs> Ow! Oh, I gotta hand it to you, Klaus, man. That really works. Hmm, didn't see that one coming. All right, back to practice. <laughs> <laughs> Back to the drawing board. Tell us the secrets of the ancient fighting soccer or you're going for a long, cold swim. All right, all right. Close your eyes and all will be revealed. That doesn't make any sense at all. Kuju is an ancient sport, shrouded in mystery. It doesn't have to make sense. <sighs> Fine. <laughs> Why would I help you? You tried to end Sheikh's career. End his career? Please! A master strategist would never use such a crude tactic. The tackle on Shakes was just a way to implant a tracking chip. That's how they found me. Wait, if Uber put a tracking device in my leg, then... <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to another epic showdown live from the Fortress Stadium. Bad news for Super Strikers fans. Despite early signs that he'd be back from his injury, Shakes has not made the squad. Guys, you need to look after yourselves out there. We can't afford any more injuries. We're already one player short. Make that two, coach. Uh, where's Klaus? Let me guess. He's working on another safety invention? Huh? <laughs> Uh, Tiger is totally right. Uh, introducing my latest safety invention, this uh, suit of armor. You were hiding, weren't you? Yeah. The only way to avoid being injured by Iron Tank is to avoid playing them. You think this game will be less physical than the last encounter, Mac? I very much doubt it, Brenda. And by the looks of it, so do Super Strikers. They're keeping their distance from the tank. And it's working. Super Strikers have a chance here. <laughs> Goal! <laughs> but El Matador is down. If he isn't celebrating, it must be bad. Yep, the game's only just started, and the men in red are two Strikers down. Close. You're going on. Yes, coach. Faster! Now, Iron Tank have a chance to attack Super Strikers' goal. Well, makes a change from attacking Super Strikers. Oh, spoke too soon. Here comes the cross, but it's way too close to the keeper. <gasps> or not. Uh -oh. Iron Tank have plotted their way back into the game. And with Shakes and El Matador out, Coach is going to need an ace up his sleeve to win this one. You can't give up now, Shakes. Um, in case you hadn't noticed, we're locked in a cell. Come on! That's nothing for Shakes from Super Strikers, right? Turns out he had a 10. Oh, cool! 
Shakes? What are you doing here? Trained in an ancient temple, hitched a ride in Iron Tank submarine, you know, the usual. I specifically told you to get your mind off Iron Tank. Kind of difficult to do when they followed him around the world. Uh, this is Shing. She taught me an ancient soccer technique. Oh, way too How many times do I have to tell you, Shakes? It's not about your technique. Now sit down. You're not playing. Man, coach is scary. Tell me about it. Go, Klaus! You can do it! <laughs> Come on, Lanky! <laughs> Give it your best, Rizzo. Let me tell you again, Shakes. I know. I'm not ready. But what other choice do we have? First, Shakes wasn't even in the squad. Then he's on the bench. And now he's playing? Hopefully he can last longer than his teammates did. Seems Shakes is more resourceful than we thought. Don't worry. He's too scared to face me. 80 minutes gone, and the scores are still tied. But Super Strikers still have some life in them. There's Shake's first involvement. Can he make the difference? Attack! Or will I and Tank run him down again? Let's see how Kuju holds up in the 21st century. Remember the Kuju legend. Time to finish the job! Yes, we did. I can't believe that tiny chip caused that much trouble. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's smash the thing! Nah, I got a better idea. This is the first mission ever. Rich of finding. It will all be worthwhile when we find out what Shakes' new secret training is. Von Eye, how close are we? Oh! Over there! Dear Uber, bet you didn't see this coming. Some pretty tough games coming up. First, Invincible United, then Super Strikers. But as always, in Coach Black, we trust. Oh. What? What is that? There's been an alien fighting. At a soccer stadium. A close encounter of the first kind. But is it legitimate? Impossible to tell. 
We need a man on the ground. Anyone know anything about football? Uh, that's the one with the ball, right? I've already identified the perfect candidate. He knows soccer. He has access to the stadium. And most importantly, he's a believer. Klaus, prepare to make contact. We've just witnessed the upset of the season, boys. Orion anticipated Invincible United's every move, predicted their every strategy, and dominated the scoreline. I know how they did it. Coach Black has been getting help. From aliens. This again? Uh, Klaus. I've watched this clip like 20 times. I'm telling you guys, it's real. There's no such thing as aliens. Those videos are just CGI. <laughs> Klaus has been spending way too much time on the bench, coach. If it isn't aliens, how did Orion know Invincible United's entire game plan? Coach Black obviously studied their previous games and learned their strategies. But what if he's done the same to us, Coach? Don't worry. I've developed two all-new, never-before-seen moves. It's of the utmost importance that we keep them top secret. That means no talking about them. I don't even want you to think about them. Because the aliens can read our brainwaves, right? Focus on these moves, not UFO sightings. Got it? Got it, coach. You'd think it was match day at the soccer sphere, but actually, Orion Stadium is now the world's newest alien sightings hotspot. Take me home, E.T. They live amongst us, man. The lights! They're coming for us! I'm now joined by Orion manager, Coach Black, live from his observatory on top of the soccer sphere. Coach Black, what do you make of these so-called UFO sightings? <laughs> the lads are merely a beautiful cosmic ray shower. Ha, huh. I bet his alien overlords told him to say that. Turn that thing off already. El Matador must go betty by. Your side destroyed Invincible United last week. Some people... Claim you were helped by, you know, these, these... Aliens? <laughs> that is priceless. <laughs> but seriously, my secret is just, uh, thorough preparation. Well, it seems like the sky is the limit for Orion. As for the UFOs, I'll leave that to the experts. The truth is totally out there, man. The lights! They're still coming for us! Why wouldn't they come to Earth? Huh? Who are you? We're a top secret organization of specialists. We search for and monitor alien activity on Earth. We're the first, second, middle, second last, and only line of defense. We are the National Extraterrestrial Reconnaissance Division. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Ow! Oh. Ah. He always does this! The intention was for this to remain a clandestine operation, you dope! Sorry, guys. If it makes you feel any better, you put on a great show. Now, what do you guys want? We know you've been watching the lights of Orion footage. Of course. It's the most conclusive proof we are not alone. We're looking for someone who can find out the truth about the lights. Someone with access to the soccer sphere? We're looking for someone like you, Klaus. What? Me? An alien hunter? Ah, uh, I can't. What? what? Why not? We've got a big game coming up. I need to concentrate on our new... <gasps> not meant to talk about them. <gasps> not even meant to think about them. Sorry, I'm not your guy. Circles. I told you guys there were aliens here. Oh, please. There is a perfectly rational explanation for this. Yep. I made them. Huh? <gasps> no wonder you wanted me to keep quiet about the aliens. You're one of them. There's no way I was going to teach you the top secret. 
you know what, then practice them at Orion's home stadium the day before the game. So I created the most private training facility in town. This is the last time you're going to see these moves, so pay attention. No peeking, defenders. We're going to test these moves on you guys. Move one uses the overlap to find space behind the defense. Ain't getting past us, bro. I know, but El Matador will. Move two uses pace and passing to break through the opposition defense. Nice work, boys. You get all that? I may need you out there tomorrow. Yes, coach. There's no way Orion will see these moves coming. Haven't you watched that video enough? Beauty sleep required. Where is your rational explanation for this, El Matador? Ah, uh, that is just uh, Orion testing their floodlights. Floodlights coming from the sky? Well, it still makes more sense than aliens. You're so sure about it, let's go find out. Reports are streaming in. It's happening again. That's not all. Klaus is on the move, heading right for the stadium. Ha! I knew he couldn't resist the search for the truth. Wait, we're tracking Klaus? <gasps> you guys never tell me anything. Yeah, that's because you tell your mom all our secret information. No, I don't. Hmm. Klaus seems to have activated the camera on his Digitab. I should be able to access the feed. Wow! <laughs> Mom! You gotta see this! Oh, Super League legends sneaking around like grave robbers. I can't believe I let you talk me into this. Klaus? Huh? Am I dreaming? Only if you are dreaming about how right I was. Hey, is it just me, or are these lights following a pattern? a pattern, yeah? Definitely a sign of intelligent life. <laughs> Match day. On for Orion, take on the mighty Super Strikers. Here at the Soccer Sphere, it's come one, come all for alien enthusiasts. Although someone needs to tell them they're here to watch the football, not the skies. 
One man who will definitely be keeping his eyes on the game is Orion's coach, Black, still in his observatory. Yes, Lina. From up here, I have a perfect view of the galaxy and what's happening on the beach. Hmm. The lights, <laughs> they're coming. <laughs> they take your brain waves. Wow, I didn't know crazy was contagious. What's gotten into you, El Matador? What? There's something inside me? Ah, oh, they laid their alien eggs inside of me! Oh, get them out! Get them out! <laughs> Tell me, Klaus, where do you think El Matador got all these crazy ideas? You got to listen to me. The lights, they were... Say lights one more time. I dare you. As for you, I don't care if an alien invited you to a tea party. You're in the starting lineup. Game on! Super Strikers may be in good form, but they've never played against a team receiving help from out there. Oh, Mac, not you too. <laughs> I'm just getting into the spirit of things, Brenda. Almost as if they're getting help from... Don't you say it, Mac. Move one. Daring pass from Dancing Rasta. They obviously practiced that one in training. But Twisting Tigers run straight into a dead end. Oh, no, he hasn't. Ha -ha! Brilliant deception from Super Strikers. Wow. Oh. Heads up. <laughs> no way. Once again, Orion are just too good. How did Maida know? Last chance of the first half. Come on, dude. It's up to us. Okay, let's do it, Shakes. Huh? Ah! <laughs> They're here! Aliens! <laughs> El Matador's certainly keen to get back to the locker room. Maybe he needs the toilet. <laughs> Phew! That was a close one. Huh? Coach! You can sub me, drop me from the team, make me wash everyone's dirty socks, but you have to listen to me about the lights. Ugh, fine. You have my attention. The lights I saw last night were tracing out the exact patterns of our secret moves. Even if I did believe you, how can you prove this? I recorded it all on my Digitab last night. But I dropped it. Face it, Klaus. You don't have proof because there's no such thing as aliens. <sighs> the truth is in here. What is this? National Extraterrestrial Reconnaissance Division at your service. And we are the nerd. Really? What are you guys doing here? We've been trying to contact you, man. Uh, last night in the cornfield? That was you? You scared the pants off me. Why did you dress like that? Uh, why wouldn't we dress like this? There's something you all need to see. Klaus, we accessed the video you recorded on your Digitab last night. Well, I never. Klaus is right. Those lights are following the exact patterns of our moves. And check this out. Beta? So that's how Orion knew our first secret move. But where are the lights coming from? Please don't say aliens. The truth is actually up there. It's 
finished! Super Strikers, you can try any secret move you want, but you won't stand a chance against Orion. Because I have reached new heights of football excellence! <laughs> Space, no one can hear you laugh. Huh? Uh, so where's Coach Black? <coughs> Observe. He was up in space the whole time. After surveilling your moves from his space station, he traced them out with the lights, teaching his players how to counter them. And the UFO hysteria was the perfect cover-up. I knew there was something weird about those interviews. <laughs> <sighs> Klaus, you have great intuition, both on and off the pitch. I should have trusted you more. Uh, sorry to ruin the moment, but how's knowing this gonna help us in the second half? Yeah, we only have one move left, and you know the cat's out of the bag on that one. Well, Coach Black doesn't know that we are onto him. What are you thinking, Klaus? I have an idea for another new move. With the score still deadlocked, Coach is making his first substitution. Strange decision. Klaus hasn't been on the first team for ages. Ah, hello, Mr. Snooper Striker. You were terrified of the lights last night, but you're about to find out how scary they really are. <laughs> Move to brothers, come on. <laughs> Just as expected. <laughs> You're watching. Shakes to Twisting Tiger. Back to Shakes. <laughs> another move, another failure. Orion saw the danger a mile away. Nowhere to go, Shakes. <laughs> But Orion have left Klaus open in the middle. That's not move two. Follow Klaus. Follow Klaus. Follow Klaus! What? Believer Brenda. No comment. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> Wait, that means Super Strikers won, right? No idea. Yes! They won! Yeah! <laughs> I gotta call my mom! Yeah! Yeah! Wow! Wow! <laughs> <laughs> How did they do it? I hate them! I hate them! I... Self-destruct <laughs> mechanism activated. No! Yes, you have 20 seconds to enter the escape pod. Stupid ship! You have 10 seconds to enter the escape pod. Star. <laughs> Make a wish, bro. Ha, ah, it already came true. We won. I like to say, man, man. <laughs> 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 
It's me, Shakes. You know, the guy who's always sticking his nose in other people's business. Blargal, blargal. Blah, 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 blah. Yes, brilliant. Thanks, Tony. <laughs> Not you, Chuck T. Jefferson. My television glasses. The glasses you are wearing are the perfect training device. I can load any player from any team into your field of vision. I've even got managers, reporters, all kinds of stuff. I don't know, Tony. These things make me feel like I'm going crazy. Oh, wait. There we go. Better? Hi, Tony. Can I try the movie glasses? John J. Johnson, Jr., you're supposed to be sorting out the vermin problem. You don't need to worry about the skunk, Tony. I've taken care of it. The stink bag is finally gone? You'll never see that skunk again. <laughs> you give me those glasses right now! <laughs> Technovision isn't a toy. It should only be used for training. <gasps> or sabotage. <laughs> <laughs> no, really, I must be like 20 feet high. El Matador, you've scored 10 goals in four games. What is the secret to your phenomenal form? Well, Lena, when I look my best, I play my best. The shiny teeth. The giant head. The perfect hair. The incredible self-indulgence. And the finishing touch. My custom design, super expensive, one-of-a-kind glasses. Ooh. Ouch! Nobody touches the glasses. They're so copyright protected, if I try to make another one, I'd have to sue myself. Hurry up, El Matador. Coach is waiting. You can't rush perfection. Ugh. <laughs> Dude takes more showers in a day than I do in a month. Uh, well, it's working. Celebrity Stalker magazine says El Matador is the hottest player in the Super League right now. What? They were handing them out for free on the plane. Uh, no they weren't. We got here on the striker jet. El <laughs> <laughs> Matador is the best player. He is the one all fans adore. El la 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 My redesign worked. It's the perfect replica. With a bit of technovision magic, of course. Huh? Oh, uh, I'm looking great. Uh, Gonna uh, score lots of goals today. Uh, Ew, a skunk. I'm getting out of here. The skunk. Mm. Oh, it stinks. When I get my hands on you, I'm gonna... Drap. Hmm, my glasses feel kind of weird. Did you guys mess with them? Nobody touched your glasses, man. Yeah, don't want to get sued. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's get down to business. First of all, we'll map up Hello? our defensive response. Tony? We'll expect a tight defense around the goal. Nope, but there. A staggered defense. Tony even lets Super Strikers use the movie glasses. Hmm, if I can't use the movie glasses, Maybe I can make the movies. <laughs> it's showtime! Technicali have been very good in attack, overwhelming the opposition with their numbers. But pushing all their men forward leaves the defense exposed. Huh. And we got just the man to make them pay. Right, El Matador? Huh? <gasps> El Matador! I swear something feels weird about my glasses. <sighs> Let's do it, guys. We got to be prepared for Technicali. Yeah. Who knows what that madman Tony Verne is up to? Day one. It stinks so much. I have stuffed El Matador's socks into my nose to block out the smell. It isn't working. I got it! <laughs> no, you don't! Oh. What 
should I do for my first scene? El Matador! Can I get a photo? Uh, who do you work for? I only appear in A-list magazines. Uh, um... Ponytail magazine? Oh, of course. Uh, just make sure you get my good side. Ah, go! And cut. What a scene. John J. Johnson, <gasps> Jr.? What are you doing in my lap? Oh, nothing, Tony. Ew! What's that smell? I don't want to talk about it. A matador. I was wide open. Sorry, Shakes. I was going to pass, but that reporter wanted my photo for the cover of Ponytail Magazine. Uh, <laughs> what reporter, dude? That guy, right over... Huh? He must have already got what he needed. I am very photogenic. Anyway, a good practice, guys. I'm gonna go take a shower. Did you guys see a reporter? Mm -hmm. <gasps> According to Pointless Gossip Magazine, El Matador is showing all the signs of a celebrity breakdown. I bought it for a friend, okay? Oh, yeah? What's his name? Never mind that. It says that the clear signs of a complete mental breakdown are paranoia. He was convinced someone touched his glasses. Hallucinations. Like the invisible reporter from Ponytail Magazine. <laughs> Anything else we should be looking out for, man? An urge to trash hotel rooms. <gasps> How about locker rooms? What? I'm sorry, El Matador, but this is for your own good. What is? A celebrity intervention! Get him! Uh, how many times do I have to tell you guys? Some mysterious intruder messed with my glasses, a skunk trashed our locker room, and the reporter took my photo at practice. Uh, denial is a clear sign of a celebrity breakdown. You guys are just jealous that they chose me for the cover of Ponytail Magazine. I looked it up. There's no such thing as Ponytail Magazine. Yeah, dude. Ponytails went out of fashion in the 80s. How dare you? Uh, Shakes, you believe me, right? Uh, I... I uh... Fine. I'm going to go hang out with someone who knows what it's like to be a big superstar. <laughs> all right, all right, we get it. That went well. I'll go speak to him. Well, hurry up or you'll lose him, Shakes. Well, not unless you know the big superstar he's going to hang with. But we are in Hollywood. That could be anyone. Don't worry. There's only one big superstar El Matador listens to. Oh, El Matador. It's tough being a misunderstood, rich, incredibly handsome soccer star. I know how you feel. <gasps> John J. Johnson Jr.? Tony never trusts me to do anything. But he's not here. <laughs> but I still believe in myself, no matter what anyone says. Uh, do you always go out dressed like that? Uh... The 80s are back. Spandex is totally fashionable. <laughs> you should tell that to Norshaw. My ponytail is so in. Congratulations on making the cover of Ponytail Magazine, by the way. Why, thank you. Hey, how did you know about that? Uh, news travels fast in Hollywood. OK, this is my big chance. What do all good movies need? <gasps> Drama. El Matador, what's wrong? Uh, my teammates think I've gone crazy. Say, do you hear that music? Mm-mm. Drama. Check. What else? Action! Mm -hmm. <laughs> you ninjas! What are we gonna do, John J. Johnson Jr.? What do you want? We are jealous of your awesome ponytail. Give it to us or face the consequences. You want my ponytail? Come and get it. So be it. Bro, we're bros, and bros shouldn't fight. Right, bro? Nah, lame. El Matador, we're all just worried about you. C come back. Pff, sound like his mom. El Matador, being in a team is all about trust. What I'm trying to say is, I don't think you're... 
Ninjas were after my ponytail. El Matador, I think you should look at this. Huh? <laughs> oh, man. Klaus was right. I am having a celebrity breakdown. The game against Technicali. It's tomorrow. Oh, shakes. What am I going to do? Maybe you need to sit it out? You wouldn't tell Coach, would you? Dude. We have a chance to beat Technicali on their home turf. Come on! I'm your friendly, super reliable, goal-getting strike partner. I'll be fine. Match day at the hub. And it looks like Technicali are sticking to their attacking formation. With El Matador in Red Hot form, they'll be torn apart. So, Shakes, dude. What happened with the Lord of the Shower Rings over there? Yeah, is he seeing things all way? Is he in the right frame of mind to play? Well... Hey, guys! Yeah. What are you talking about? Yeah, uh, like I was saying, he's totally fine. Day two. The smell isn't going away. But I must remain focused on my mission. All right, El Matador, it's showtime! And we're off! <laughs> Cheeky shakes! And highly effective! <laughs> El Matador has an early opportunity here! He's clean through! Huh? Where'd you guys come from? From your worst nightmare! Shakes, come back to you! Instead of shooting, El Matador passes to a marked man! It works! I'm a genius! Wide open, dude. Yeah, I know. Oh. Oh, trouble here for Super Strikers. Electrifying stuff from the Technicali boys. Oh. Technicali achieve on their first try what El Matadors failed to do the entire half. Dude, you're not handling the pressure. I gotta tell Coach about. Ah, whatever, Shakes. It's like John J. Johnson Jr. said. I gotta believe in myself no matter what anyone says. Wait, when did you see him? Uh, last night, just before the ninja attack. He wasn't real, was he? <laughs> but if El Marigo wasn't lying about the skull, then... John, who's on the cover of this month's Ponytail Magazine? El Matador, obviously. Uh, I mean, i uh, never heard of Ponytail Magazine. Uh, gotta go. Bye. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Shakes knows about Technovision. Oh, I gotta fix this. Hey, I thought those glasses were only meant for training. Tony? Why did Tony ask us to meet him here? Tony! Oh. Ooh. Oh, yes! Much better! What have you done? It wasn't me. It was the skunk. I'm talking about El Matador's glasses. I thought you might need a little help with, uh, you know, winning. Oh. oh, quit moaning. You have a goal. But I want goals fair and square. Now, listen. El Matador is being subbed as we speak. Hang back. Defend your lead and the game is yours. Any questions? Yeah. What's that smell? Oh. I think it's obvious that one of us has a serious problem. All right, I admit it. I am addicted to the gossip magazines. I need help. 
you were talking about El Matador, weren't you? Guys, I just saw a skunk. Uh, good for you, dude. Don't you get it? It means El Matador wasn't lying about trashing the locker room. And that's not all. John J. Johnson Jr. knows about Ponytail Magazine. How would he know about a made-up magazine? Because he's the one who made it up. So what is going on? Whoa, whoa, easy there, brother. <gasps> oh, God. Okay, keep cool, John J. Johnson Jr. You gotta get to El Matador before Shakes does. Hmm? What? What? <laughs> Hi, El Matador. Uh, listen, buddy, I'm not feeling that good, so when I come back into the change room in a moment, I may be acting a little crazy. Ha! You know the rules, Shanks. Uh. I'm calling my law. Oh. <laughs> hmm? So you just ignore everything I say. We need you on the field for the second half. Okay, he's gone. Huh? Tony Byrne swapped your glasses for some kind of VR projection goggles. I... I'm not crazy. Can you play without your glasses? No, coach. Then I'm gonna have to sub you. Uh, Tony Byrne sabotaged my game and made you guys think I was crazy and worst of all, touch my glasses. You gotta let me get back at him. Hmm. The two sides emerge for the second half, and first out is El Matador. I'm surprised he's on the field at all after his terrible first half performance. They didn't sub him? Oh, well, El Matador, you're about to find out what this baby can really do. El Matador on the attack. Can he find some form in the second half? Ha! I'd be surprised if he can even find the ball the way he's been playing. <laughs> 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 Oh, you got past two players. Here's ten more! What's he gonna do, people? He's gonna pass to himself. Oh! Technovision is meant to make him worse, not better! How about some special effects to liven things up? <laughs> Nobody touches the glasses. Tail magazine. <laughs> That'll do. Back to me. <laughs> Eat this, Fido. Amazing. Unbelievable. than being crazy. <laughs> Sorry we didn't trust you, man. Ah, don't worry. It was Tony's fault. Are we gonna teach that sucker a lesson? Well, Spiteful Teen Magazine has an article on the 10 best ways to get back at an ex-BFF. Don't worry, guys. I already know how to make Tony pay. Get your high-tech augmented reality technoglasses right here 
<sighs> At least I can make my money back on these stupid things. <laughs> Boss, I found some people interested in the movie glasses. Ah, welcome, welcome. And who do I have the pleasure of doing business with? El Matador's lawyers. We're here to talk to you about copyright infringement. <gasps> what is that smell? I <sighs> don't want to talk about it. 